Hiya, so today we're doing LBT, but we're going to do it in a slightly different format than usual. Um, well, usual for me. So what you're going to do is we're going to start off standing and we're going to do a move. Then we're going to do a new move and do the, then the first move. Then we're going to do another new move and then do the second move, then the first move. And then we're going to do that until we've done four full different moves. So, and then we're going to do the floor work. Same principle. Don't worry about the details because I'm going to tell you each time what you're going to do. You'll get the principle. It's just I'm a bit rubbish explaining things. So anyway, so we're going to start off, but we need a little bit of a, a warm up. So we're just going to bring those legs round. I hope everybody's loving this weather. Been out on my bike this morning. A really tough ride actually, lots of big hills. So my legs at the moment are like, you having a key? are you having a laugh, love? So bring your knees up. Just pull them up to your chest. And then we're gonna step forward and back. You're gonna go forward with your heel down, your toe up. Then we're going to go in the opposite direction and press that heel down then step back forward so it's back and in. Press that heel down. I always say this but you take as long as you need on the warm up. I'm just doing a very very quick example. So let's have a twist. Let's put our hands on our hips and have a big full circle. Just a few each way. Keep one hand on your hip, reach over to the side. Come back to do the other way. Other side. Roll your shoulders. So, what we're going to do, we're going to start with a reverse lunge. We're going to do one leg at once. And we're going to do 10 lots, 10 reps. So, what you're going to do is you're going to step back, dip that knee, and back. I'm not like this. I'm back, down, and up. Bring that foot back in. Other leg, down, and up, back in. So, we're going to do 10 each side. Two, hopefully without falling over. Try and keep that chest up. Three. A lot to do with balance this four. So I'll go the other way as well, show you from the front. You're back on the, uh, the ball of your foot. Step back as far as you can manage. You're going to do a lot of these lunges because we keep re repeating the same move after we've added another one. Do one more of those, one more each side. Remember I'm back, my chest is up, I'm not leaning forward. From here we're going to do a side raise to a rear press, well we're doing a side raise to a rear raise if you like, so foot flexed. Raise out to the side, push back. Out to the side, push back. Raise with the side of your foot, not your toe. Just keep going, do your best. I'm going to do 10 on each side. You don't have to raise it high. But you have to keep that leg straight and press with that heel and lower with control. Last one on this side, then straight into the other side. Remember, keep that foot flexed. It's straight out to the side, then straight up and behind. Obviously, 10 on this side as well. Then from this, we're going to go back to those lunges. Keep breathing. Do 
Just do as much as you can. This is your last one. Back into those lunges. Have a bit of a wiggle, not much of a rest, not a proper rest. Back into them. And you can go a little bit faster if you can. So that's... Again, we're doing 10. That's five. You can have your arms anywhere you want. It doesn't really matter. Remember, we're just going straight back, keeping that chest up. We're not touching the floor with that knee. We're just dipping it down. We've got one more each leg. Beautiful. Have a bit of a wiggle, just a bit of a wiggle with those legs. The next thing you're gonna do, I'll do it from an angle. You're gonna lift that knee up, extend that leg out, bring it in and down, then do the other side. So up, straighten, down, in and down. Try and keep this thigh high up. Try and keep your knee high. Then after this, we're going to go back to those side to rear raises. Once more, 10 on each leg. On these. Again, we're watching that balance. Just do it from a different angle. <laughs> she says, falling over. It's because I moved. Just pressing that leg out. We're again keeping that foot flexed. Watch that posture. Stay standing up. All the way up with that chest. Last one on each leg. You're raising that knee as high as you can. Beautiful, straight into that uh, side raise. So it's out, back, out, back. Remember, I am not pointing that toe to the side. I'm working with that heel. The side of my foot is going up, not my toe. My toe is still pointing forward. One more on this side. Straight in. On that rear raise, if it helps, you can lean forward slightly. Both legs remain straight. But on the side raise, try to prevent yourself from leaning to the other side. What I mean is don't do that. Do your best to stay upright. Then remember, we're back to those beautiful lunges. One last one of these. For now. Bit of a wiggle. <laughs> back to those lunges. So... Where am I? So I'm going to step back, down, and push back up. Back, down, push back up. Keep that chest lifted. Step back onto the ball of that foot. You're looking straight ahead. I'm not leaning forward. I'm not looking down. Again, you can have your hands anywhere you want. It doesn't really matter. We're not using that upper body at the moment. Just try to stick with that technique. Just dipping that knee down a little bit and pushing back up through that back toe. Come on. After this, we're gonna add the last new move, which is a basic bodyweight squat. 
beautiful wiggle it out so feet quite wide toes slightly out chest up shoulders back and down and what i'm going to do i'm not doing this i'm doing this i'm going back and down and pushing up so that's your technique you're looking straight ahead you're sticking that bum back push your gut through those heels and pressing those hips forward at the top Go on, do your best. All your weight should be in your heels. Not in your toes. There should be no weight going onto those toes at all. I'm not asking you to wiggle your toes, but I'm just saying you should be able to. There's one last one of these. Beautiful. 10 squats. Oh. Then we're back to the knee up and extend. Up, extend, bring back, lower. Other leg, extend, back, lower. Come on, do your best. Keep breathing. Remember, if you need that water at any point, have a sip. And just get straight back into it when you can. That foot remains flexed all the time. Remember, that means that angle from your ankle. You're not pointing your toe. Got two more each side. I'll turn around again. This is your last one. Each side. We're back to those side to rear raises, so let's go. Out, back, out, back. Remember to try and keep that straight position. It's not always easy to prevent yourself from sort of leaning like that, but try your best. That's this stuff going on. Stabilizing that position. Straight behind. Last one on this side. Let's change over. Keep those shoulders back. Remember that chest up. I'm going to move slightly so you can see the position of my foot. I hope you can see that properly. I'm raising with the side of my foot, leading with my heel. I'm not going like that. Oh, I don't like doing that, even, even as a demonstration. It does my head in. Do we remember those lunges next? Of course we do. Last one on this side of these. Let's go straight into those lunges. Back, down and in. Back, down and in. Remember, I'm not leaning forward. I'm up. But that also means don't lean backwards. My arms are going all over the place, but it doesn't really matter. We're going to do that full circuit one more time. But we're going to do five of each. So one more of these. We're going to split it in half and just do one little blast of everything. So straight in, feet apart. Five squats. Two three, four, five, knee raise to extension, one, don't do these too quickly, focus on those muscles, two, 
three, two more each side, last one, back to those side to rear raises, let's go, out, back, a little bit faster, out, back, two more, on this side, one, remember we've cut it in half, we're only doing five, this last little bit, your last one, beautiful lunges, try and speed it up a bit this time, one, two, do your best to be balanced, oh, I always fall over when I say things like that, three, step back as far as you can, four, five, shake your legs out, kick them out, right, we're on the floor, let's go, our first move, heel touches, so, Back pressed in. Um, let me, I can't really do it properly, can I? For you to see me properly. Oh, that's not good. <clears throat> so, on the floor, back press into the floor, um, palms facing down, knees up, feet down, shoulders off the floor, and I'm reaching in towards my heels. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Next, it's uh, what is it next? Um, uh, sit up to jab. <clears throat> I forgot what I've done for my abs. So you're gonna pull up, jab, jab, pull up, jab, jab. Two. Oh. Three, keep those elbows tucked in. Four, five, bit of force in that jab. One more. Back into those heel touches, feet down, knees up. One, two, three, keep going. Four, Five, halfway there, keep going for ten. One last one each side. Leg raises, hands under your bum, back pressed in, shoulders off the floor if you can. You don't have to. You can have you can be laid fully down and you've got your legs together and you're gonna raise and lower. 10 times, keep those feet off the floor if you can. I'm gonna put my head down for a little bit, just to show you that that's okay. If your neck hurts, you've got two more. Oh, all the way up. Bring those feet down. Just have a very quick breather. You're back to, what are you back to now? Sit up to jab. I thought so, but for some reason it didn't work. So back to those, jab, jab. Keep those feet on the floor as much as you can. Roll all the way back down and then pull yourself back up. Come on, it's hard. It's not an easy workout because you're not getting much rest. Come on, Ugh. roll all the way back down. This is your last one, down. Quick, quick, quick breather. Feet in, knees up, back to your heel touches. Shoulders off the floor, reach. Palms are facing down, only just off that floor. This is your last one. 
Beautiful. Oh, right. Glute bridge, your last move of this little circuit. So your knees are up again. Your feet are on the floor. Your hands are down. You can have them quite wide. It's always a struggle getting the angle. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to push up with those hips all the way up and squeeze your bum at the top. Then roll slowly back down. Push all the way up. Try not to touch the floor. Just force those hips as high as you can get them. Keep those legs together. You, you can, like I've said, you can have your hands on the floor if that helps. You've got two more. Beautiful. What was that? I forgot what were next. Leg raises. Hands under your butt. Leg straight out. And I'm lifting up and lowering down. I've got my shoulders off the floor. I've got my back pressed into the floor. I've got my hands under that butt. And I'm breathing. I'm trying to keep those feet off the floor. My legs are completely straight. That's an awesome angle, isn't it? <laughs> Last one. Beautiful. Feet down. Get ready for that. Ooh. Get ready for that sit up to jab. Go. Jab, jab. Roll down, pull up. Jab, jab. Come on, we're nearly at the end. Put a bit of power into that jab. Two more. Last one. We're back to those heel touches. Feet down, knees up, palms facing the ground. And we're reaching. We're breathing as well. You should really feel this by now. Keep those knees together. That's your last one. Just relax. Just for a few seconds. We're going to do that full circuit one more time. Five, five times each. So let's remind ourselves it's the glute bridge first. Just five of them. Glute bridge leg raise, sit up, heel touch. Right, hands down or just resting on your hips. That's up to you. Feet on the floor, knees straight up. And you're going to push up, down, up, down. Roll that spine. Keep that bum off the floor if you can. It's your last one. Hands under your bum. Back into the floor, legs straight out, raise, lower, raise, lower. Remember, we're only doing five this time. Last one, beautiful. Feet down, get ready for five sit-ups to jab. Come on, oh, where am I? I don't know where I am. And go, sit-up jab five times Ugh. last one Ugh. straight into position for those heel touches and again they are called heel touches doesn't mean you actually have to touch your heel keep those legs in together keep those knees together just move last one Ugh. awesome awake work so that's 24 minutes so the, the workout itself must have been around about 20 minutes just over my hair what's it what's it all about beautiful that's plenty if you want more do more do it twice do more reps just 
get the technique correct and you you just work the work it, it to your advantage you do what you can do i want you to push yourself i don't want you to hurt yourself so there you go that's today's workout lbt and uh, i hope you've enjoyed it and i hope you've enjoyed my, my hair because you know that's mostly why you're all watching let's be honest so <laughs> fitness by susie have a lovely day please stay safe please stay active and i'll see you tomorrow bye bye for now